Hello YouTube, Jeff Steele here with Steele Navigator. Today I wanted to make a video on the topic of natural peanut butter and the real reason for it. So really this could be applied to other nut butters as well, such as almond butter. But I'm just going to focus on peanut butter in this video. So growing up, peanut butter was a real staple in my family's diet. It's fairly inexpensive, good fats, high protein content, and quite tasty. And so we always kept a jar or several in the house at all times. Later on in the years, natural peanut butters were introduced and they have moved even more so into not just natural but organic peanut butters as well. So I'm always on the hunt for the next best peanut butter. Growing up, it was the Red Top Jif peanut butter. But as I became more and more educated in regards to diet and what I was putting in my mouth, started looking at the ingredient list. And I don't buy anything today without reading every ingredient. So the old standard peanut butters, there was quite a list in the ingredients. Two in particular, hydrogenated and partially hydrogenated oils. It could be a variety of, of different types of oils, but they are hydrogenated or partially hydrogenated. Those are fancy words and terms for trans fat, the worst fat we can put in our bodies. So that's number one. Usually natural peanut butters do not have either of those. Also, there is excess sugar in the non-natural peanut butters. And I've even seen artificial sweeteners such as high fructose corn syrup. I've seen that. And if we, don't, if we don't know much about high fructose corn syrup, it's like sludge in our intestines. So those are three reasons to go with natural peanut butter, the trans fat, getting that out, the excess sugar and artificial sweeteners. And we're getting into also organic peanut butters today. I've tried a variety of just the standard natural peanut butters. They don't have the trans fats in them, but I found that most of the natural peanut butters are really oily and really sweet. A little too much for my taste as far as it being real, real runny, the, it's just very oily and it's just a little too sweet for me. So again, I'm always looking for the next peanut butter. I've had a couple good ones, but this is the best I have found so far. And this is Smucker's Organic Natural Peanut Butter. I get the chunky instead of creamy. It's a little thicker, a little drier, and I just prefer a thicker, drier, saltier peanut butter. Some people might like the runnier, or softer, sweeter peanut butters. It just depends on preference there. Ingredients here. Organic roasted peanuts contains 1% or less of salt. And that's it. That's all that's in here. Nothing else. I dare you to compare a jar of this to a jar of the standard Red Top Jif peanut butter. This is, again, as far as my personal preference, taste, texture, this is the best I've found. Excellent, highly recommend it. Let's start a conversation on this. What natural, organic peanut butters do you like? What's the best you've found? I'm always looking for the next best peanut butter. Like, subscribe, comment down below. Hope you enjoy the video. Have a great night.